Welcome to Film Studios 5, I'm Shiv Mehta. Now, the most important part of any movie is your script. The script is the blueprint to your entire film. Now, whether you're a seasoned screenwriter or just starting out, I'm going to be guiding you through the essential steps to creating a compelling screenplay. Now, before you can even begin the process of plotting your story for your script, it's very important that you have brainstormed and come up with an idea for your film. And if you haven't done so, then please be sure to check out my last video, which was called Five Awesome Ways to Come Up with a Film Idea. There's a link to it in the description below and also in the i description up here. So please be sure to check it out. When it comes to you know crafting a compelling script, the first thing you need is a really strong story. And strong stories answer fundamental questions like who it is about, what are they experiencing, what will change, and finally how. If you can write these questions down and really think through your answers and make sure that you're answering in a way that fulfills your story and fulfills your idea, you will have a strong, solid story to you know begin your plotting process with and ultimately create a really compelling script with. When writing your script, it's really important to create an outline for your story and to structure it using the 3X structure. Every story should have a beginning, middle, and end, or a first act, a second act, a third act, or a fourth act, depending on your story. In the first act, or the beginning as it's known, you should always introduce your characters, the world that they live in, the rules that they live by, and you should lay out the obstacles that they face. You should give your audience an idea of okay, your character has this dream, but why are they not able to achieve it? What is stopping them? And by the end of your first act, you should always put the inciting incident, meaning the event that pushes your character into action as this helps link the first and second act. And in act two, you raise the stakes for your character when it comes to achieving their goal. You make them adapt to the hard situation that they're facing, you push them and you make them motivated to achieve the goal that they want, whether it is to become a teacher, a dancer, um, whether it is to become the savior of the world, whatever your story is about, you have to make sure that in act two, you make the audience really feel like, oh, they're gonna achieve this goal, it's gonna be easy, but of course, if you don't want your story to be boring, you always have to have an obstacle that prevents them from immediately achieving their goal. As you know, we're trying to create a really compelling script. And finally, in your third or fourth act, you should wrap up the story and reach a resolution. Has your character changed? Have they reached their goal or have they failed? It really depends on your story and it's really important to think these things out and to write them out in an outline before you get into writing your script. This will really help you and really ensure that your characters are following the beats that should be followed in every movie and every script that there has been since the beginning of time. Now that we've discussed what you should do before writing your script in order to create a compelling screenplay, let's dive into the actual writing process. Now when writing your screenplay, it's really important that you write compelling and fully thought through characters. Your characters have to have flaws, beliefs, principles, values. You have to think of them as a human being. And it can be easier when you're a first time writer to include you know, a few traits of your own and to you know, spice them up into the person that maybe you want to be in your life, but haven't reached that point yet. And it's really important that your character at the beginning of the story is completely different to who they are at the end of the story. And this is called a character arc. It's essentially a journey that your character goes through emotionally, internally, externally, to reach a point of having changed and becoming a different person or a different version of themselves. This is really important because human beings, you know, we change due to circumstances and situations that we face in life. And this is what's gonna make your audience like your characters. The more flawed and complex they are, the more emotions and heartstrings you can tug at and the better and more compelling your script will become. Now, the next thing you should consider when writing your script or your scenes. You have to make sure that your scenes, you know, advance the plot of your story and add to your character's growth and development. We really want to avoid writing scenes that are filler or simply putting them in there because we want to make our script longer or we want to move the story along. It's important that every scene has a purpose 
and answers your story's core question. For example, if you're doing a story about trust, every scene should address the theme of trust in a different way. Let's just say your protagonist makes a decision because they don't trust someone and it costs them and makes it harder to reach that goal. Or let's just say your story is about friendship, right? And your um, protagonist and their best friend break up. That's also a price that they have to pay. In your story, there's always payoffs and prices that your characters experience because of the decisions that they make in the story. And if you can make sure that all your scenes really address, you know, the core tenets of your story and are valuable and are adding to the plot, you can have that much more of a compelling and interesting script. Another crucial aspect to creating a compelling screenplay is dialogue. It's really important to make sure that your dialogue is contributing to the story, but also reveals your character's personality and the relationships that they have. It's very important that you don't use your dialogue constantly in your screenplay to supply information, to give the audience hints and clues, because the more you rely on dialogue, the more chunkier your script becomes and it does affect the pacing as you have more and more pages when you write more and more dialogue. So sometimes less is more. Really think about your dialogue, pick a few key scenes where your characters have fights and make sure that those fights, you know, push the story forward and add to the overall drama of your screenplay. It can also help if you give your characters like distinct accents and differentiate them from one another, particularly if you're writing a story with four characters, which is the maximum I recommend for writing your first short, you know, film script. And finally, just make sure that your dialogue sounds natural and is natural to you as a writer. Don't pressure yourself into writing really flowery or cinematic dialogue. Sometimes simple, straight lines are much better than complicated, philosophical, flowery words can ever be. And that's all for today's video on how to craft a compelling screenplay. I hope these tips were useful for you. Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below your thoughts. What's your process when it comes to writing a compelling screenplay? I'd love to hear that from you guys. And please be sure to subscribe to the channel for more film related content like this and to ring the bell to be notified when I upload, which is every third Friday. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.